everyone, today I'm going to be doing a Shop Messe haul. I haven't gotten anything from there in a really long time, so I was watching another YouTube video. Um, it was a Shop Messe haul, and you know how it is when you're just looking at YouTube videos and you're like, oh my gosh, I want to buy something, and then you just end up buying stuff too. So I didn't spend a whole lot. Um, if you don't know what Shop Miss A is, it's a website where everything is pretty much a dollar. I think that there's only a couple of things that are maybe more than a dollar, just like certain like charms and stuff for like bracelets, but um, pretty much everything is a buck, so great deals on stuff. Um, I've ordered from there before and I've been pretty happy with most of the stuff that I've gotten. Um, some things I have gotten that I wasn't like really pleased with the quality, but for the most part, um, it definitely is worth a dollar in my opinion. So anyway, I placed an order and it came the other day. I already looked at everything just to make sure that, you know, I got everything that I ordered. So I am just going to show you guys what I placed. Now they update, um, they put up new things like, I don't know if it's on a daily basis, but there probably is more new stuff since when I placed my order. So I'm just going to show you guys what I got. I spent I spent $8 and then with shipping my total came to $11.95 because their shipping cost is $3.95 which is not bad um, as far as shipping costs go. So without further ado, I am going to get into what I got. Um, they always package everything really nicely to make sure nothing breaks and they use this pretty orange tissue paper and bubble wrap and all that good stuff. So the first thing that I bought was this um, fuzzy pink and white polka dotted um, head wrap and I haven't opened this yet to like feel how soft it is or anything but this is just like one of those um, bands that you put around your kind of tight this is like something that you would put on um, when you're uh, cleaning your face or putting on like a mask or something that you would just wear black. So I probably look really stupid with my hair pulled back like that. But it's just to keep um, the hairs off your face for when you're taking off your makeup, putting on your makeup, um, or just like applying like masks and stuff like that. So they had, they had all different colors. I chose the pink with the white polka dots. Um, these are really, really, really soft, very good quality. Um, so this is definitely worth a dollar in my opinion. And this is just kind of weird, but this is what the tag looks like. I guess that's the brand called Melody. It just has this cute little girl on the front and like nothing on the back. It's almost like it's her picture. It's kind of weird. But um, anyway, got that for a dollar. Um, next thing I got was this hair clip, and I really like this. I like wearing my hair back in clips, especially in the summertime, like when I'm doing things like cleaning the house and stuff like that, because I just don't like my hair all up in my face or getting in the way when I'm trying to do mundane tasks like vacuuming or doing the dishes. So I got this. Um, hair clip and as with most of the stuff that they sell it comes in various colors um, this is the one I got which I can tell you what color I got I got the the dark leopard print if that's the one you're interested in it's the one that I got and it's um, a thick plastic and it seems like it's pretty good quality so I like it actually let me put my hair back real quick just to see how well it clips it up. Yep. Seems to work fine. Holds my hair in place great. So it definitely has um, some good enough gripper on it. So I got that and I think I've mentioned everything's a dollar. So got that. The next thing I got was this mirror. And this is just like a little compact mirror. It's called Fifi. La Pin. It is just a hand mirror. And the thing with this is you cannot choose the color. So it's random whatever color you get and like whatever the print is that you get. 
looks like the one I got. Um, she's wearing glasses. I actually do wear glasses, so that's cute. And she just got her little shoes on, a skirt, a cardigan, and a little like messenger bag. So I got that, and I'll open it up so you guys can see what it looks like outside of the packaging. It's in this little envelope. And in here, looks like this. It is, um, it kind of feels like paper, which I have a feeling is going to get, like, dirty really fast. But as far as the mirror itself, it's very big, and you can probably see yourself. Hello! Um, so, but yeah, as far as the mirror goes, it's really nice. So I got that for a dollar. But like I said, the only thing with this is you couldn't choose your color or your print or anything like that. It was just kind of like whatever they sent you. But I think it's cute anyway. They're all just like little bunny girls. So I got that. Um, I got a couple pieces of jewelry. I got this bracelet. And I will open everything out of the package. But it's just this pearl bow bracelet. Typically when I buy stuff um, on there, especially as far as bracelets go, I have pretty small wrists, so I only like to buy things that because I've had problems in the past buying bracelets and they were so big they just fell right off my wrist. So I always kind of try to look for stuff that has like adjustable links um, on the end. That way I know no matter what it should hopefully fit right. So this one is just a um, pearl bow with like little rhinestone. I just thought this was so dainty and cute. I love bows. So I'm going to put it on and see how it is. Now, <clears throat> this is a little Chinsley made. The, um, the little lobster claw here, if you can see when you open it, it it's getting stuck. So you actually have to like move that back. Now if you're like efficient in jewelry making and stuff like that like you could easily replace this with a better clasp so I mean you are getting what you pay for as far as a dollar goes um, that you may have to fix things or like better things if you know what I'm saying um, with the products that you get but it is I think worth the the dollar I just don't know if I'm going to be able to... Actually, you know what? It will probably be easier if I just do it like this. Yep. Okay. So. Can I get it on? Can I get it on? Without, like, breaking it. Okay, so this is what the bracelet looks like. And now I got... I have this on the, um, the closest link to me that I can wear it and as you can see this is how it will look on my wrist when I wear it it's gonna fall down to here and it will fall up to here on my arm so I don't think it's going to fall off which is good but it's definitely loose it's more loose than I would like it because you see how far it falls I would rather it like hit right here preferably but it's definitely like pretty big still even though I have it on the closest chain so if you have um, tinier wrists I'd be cautious about that kind of stuff because um, like ideally I would just like it to fall right here but it's just kind of fall right there it's not a huge deal but you know it's not what I would like in a bracelet but it's really cute so I can't complain too much. Like, I can get it off without even using the clasp. Um, my stupid bony wrist. Anyway, I still think it's a super cute bracelet. It seems like pretty decent quality, though, aside from that lobster clasp, which is getting stuck. Um, the other pieces of jewelry I got were this necklace, which looks like this when it's in the packaging. Um, this one is... This one I was kind of confused with the coloring, because sometimes the coloring on the website, like, you can't really tell exactly what color um, you have selected. Like, it doesn't, like, pop up 
that color, if you know what I'm saying, if you've ever ordered from there before. So I was kind of like scared that this wasn't going to be the color that I ordered because this one I got was in the color blue. And I think there was also a teal color. And to me, this looked teal. So I was very confused about that, wasn't sure which color I was actually getting. Um, but I do like this color and I'm pretty sure this is the one that I wanted to get. So I'm just going to take it out of the packaging show you guys what it looks like off the packaging if you are at all curious into purchasing yourself. So this one is, let me check the clasp on this one. This one's clasp is a little better. It's more springy. It'll open. It won't stick. Um, the beads, you know, they're plastic, but it's cute. I like it, and I think it's going to fit nicely. Like, it's going to lay, like, high up, which I like that. So, I think this one's pretty cute. So, I got that one, and this, you know, was a dollar. The last piece of jewelry I got was actually an ankle bracelet. I only have, I think, one other ankle bracelet, and I really don't wear it often. I had got it at a thrift store, I think, like years ago, and I wanted something, like, dainty and pretty, and the one I had, I think, was made of, like, those little seed beads and stuff, which is cute, but, you know, I just wanted something a little more daintier. So I got this one, which looks like this. It is um, a silver color. It has, like, a a row of like um, tennis style bracelet like rhinestones and then the other row is like a, a very small ball chain with um, little balls <laughs> little balls so I'm gonna get that out as well and show you guys and this one feels like pretty good quality check the lobster clasp on this one. This lobster clasp is nice. So, but this is what the ankle bracelet looks like. Hopefully you can see that good up close with the rhinestones and the balls. And I'm just going to put this on my um, ankle real quick just to make sure it fits okay. Um, but yeah, I think that would be really cute in the summer wearing shorts and stuff. So, got that for a dollar. They had different styles. I think they had a pretty big selection of ankle bracelets, so if that's something you're looking for, then, you know, it's it's an option. And then the last two things I got were makeup related items. The first thing I got was this um lip pencil. This is by the brand called Santee, which I had never had anything by this brand before, but the lip crayon is called Pop Pastel. And it looks like this. The shade I got was number 08. And I opened this already to look at it. It smells good. It kind of has a, um, like a fruity kind of smell. I think it smells good. So I'm just going to swatch it for you. It's this, like, really pretty, almost like, um, a pink with, like, a purpley hue. It's not like purple purple, but it's like a pinky purple. So I think that's really pretty. And it's smooth and creamy. And I like it. So I got that. Actually, I'll try to put some on. I can't see myself applying this, so I might look like a clown right now. I don't know. But yeah, it's, it's creamy. I like it. So I got that. And then the other thing I got was this. And this is by Clean Color. And it is called Par Paris Escape. It is a two-in-one lip and cheek balm. I love this packaging. I think it's really cute for a dollar. Like, super cute. Um, the color I got was called Florentine. 01 Florentine. And it's just in this big old pot. Um... Let me open it up and show you guys. I already opened this up the other day so I can see what it looked like. This one is just a really pretty baby pink color. Which looks like that. This one smells a little florally. It's got a sweet kind of smell. I like it though. 
and then you can use this on your cheeks or your lips. I would probably wear it on my lips more so than my cheeks because it's kind of like um almost has the consistency of lip gloss and I think that would be weird um putting on your cheeks. But this is what it looks like swatched. It's this one right here. So it's like a baby pink, very light. So I plan on wearing it as a lip color. But anyway, that is my Shop Miss A haul. Um, I hope you guys liked it. If you never ordered from there before, I'd just suggest checking it out. I mean, there might be something on there that you really like. They have a ton of stuff. So anyway, that is my haul. I hope you guys liked my video, and I will see you next time.